Hi there, I'm going to be showing you how to do some converting hexadecimal, decimal, and binary. So the first example that I have is we're going to convert 44,257 base 10 to hexadecimal. So first we need to realize that we're working simply from base 10 to base 16. So this means that every place value in base 10 from right to left starts at 10 to the um, power of 0 and then 10 to the power of 1 and then 10 squared and so on. The same thing for base 16. So from right to left place values are 16 to the power of 0, 16 to the power of 1, 16 squared and so on. So we're simply just going to start dividing 16 into our base 10 number. So 16 into 44, 257. 16 goes into 44 twice. It's 32, gives you 12 bring down the 2. So we're just going to do some guessing here. So 7 times 16 is 112. So we're left with 10. We're going to bring down that 5. And then we know that 6 times 16 will be less than 105. It's 96. We're left with 9. Bring down the 7. And we're left with 6. Now 97 minus 96 is 1. So we have a remainder of 1. And we're going to write that over here on the side. And we'll leave it for later. So we're going to divide 16 into 2,766 now. So 16 goes into 27 only once. And we're left with 11. We can bring down the 6, and we know from our previous long division, 7 times 16 is 112. So we're left with 4. We're going to bring down that 6. Six time, 16 times 2 is 32, and we're left with a remainder of 14. And we're going to write that over on the side. And then we're going to take 172 and we're going to divide that by 16. So 17 minus 16 is 1. Then you bring down the 2. So 16 goes into 12 zero times. So it's 10 remainder 12. I'm going to write that over on the side. Then we're going to work with the 10. We're trying to get down to a 0 with the remainder. And here we have it. So 16 goes into 10 0 times with a remainder of 10. Now Hexadecimal has 16 digits, like decimal has 10, including the integer 0. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, all the way up to 15. But the 10 through the 15 are letters A through F. So the hexadecimal number system actually is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, A for 10, B for 11, and so on, C, D, E, F. So for our solution, we read the remainders from top, bottom to top and write them from left to right. So we have A equals 10, C equals 12, E equals 14, and 1 equals 1. So our answer is ACE1 to the base 16 hexadecimal. Now we're going to convert 4CE in hexadecimal to binary. First we need to understand that every hexadecimal digit is 4 bits long. And each of these bit is 2 to the power of 0, 2 to the power of 1, 2 to the power of 2, and 2 to the power of 3. And I'll just write that underneath so we can see it visually. So each hexadecimal number have these are a um, 
total of these numbers. So 8 plus 4 is 12, plus 2 is 14, plus 1 is 15. So here's the hexadecimal numbers from 0 to F. So we have three hexadecimal digits, and they're each four bits long. We have our four, C, and E. So we're just going to start, and I have one four and zero eights, zero twos, and zero ones. Then my next digit, hexadecimal digit, is 12. So I have an eight, and I have a four, and I have zero in the two, and zero in the one. And then my E is equal to 14. That's one eight, plus one four, plus one two, and zero ones. It's that easy. So 4CE in base 16 is 01001100111110 base 2 binary. It's that simple. Thank you.